Hi YouTube, I'm back. Um, I'm back with, let's see, obviously you guys can tell by the title, it is a drugstore haul. A Walmart drugstore haul at that. Um, all of this is just um, makeup-ish products. So if you're really not into that type of stuff, y'all can leave with the video. Can you leave the video? No? Alright then. <laughs> That was lame. I know. I'm sorry. I'm still trying to. Let's just get into the products. That's why you guys are here. So, if you guys would want me to um, do swatches or like a review and me use it and then let you guys know if I think it's a repurchase or never again return it and get your money back, girl. So. Let's start off. If you guys can hear the movie, it's my children are watching the movie Stitch. So, sorry. Mommy duty, duty calls, you know? So, first I want to start with a product I've never, ever used before. And it is the... Okay, so, um, the product I've never used, like, I mean, I've used CoverGirl, Maybelline, New York Colors... Um, Georgiana and all that kind of stuff. Flower, I think it's about like Drew Barrymore, I believe. But um, anyways, I've never used those products ever. Not because like I heard bad things or whatnot, because I've heard some good things and stuff and everything. But I was there and I was like, why not just treat myself to new things? Because it's just a day to treat yourself. So why not? Um. I got this. It is a um, marker eyeliner and a mascara. It sales eye marker and volumizing mascara. And it's an intense black girl. So, I mean, I got that, yeah. So, if you guys tried any of these products I'm about to mention, leave me a comment below and let me know your thoughts on them. If they're like a repurchase or a take your money back and. Take it back and get your money back, girl. Brushes for from Flower. I got the Ultimate Eyeliner Brush, which that line looks so defined. The brush on there looks so good. So I feel like, I mean, just by the way it looks, it looks like it's a really good quality type of brush for a drugstore. This one is the Ultimate Eyeshadow Brush. And that looks like that. So... So that was all from Flower. New, let's see, the Real Techniques Bolt um, Metals Collection. I got a 200 in the, what is this, the overall shadow. That looks just so fluffy and it looks so soft. Looks amazing. I also got in the Real Techniques, it's the 101 Triangular Foundation one. And that just looks super fun to like just play with it on your face all the time this one looks like if it does turn out to be a repurchase and keep me forever this looks so much fun it's the flat contour and it looks so cute it's so cute. it looks so cute um let's see also what's new to me is the eye eyebrow sharp sharper yeah I did open these, and the only reason I purchased these is because I had seen them on another guru, Guru's page on here. You guys may know her. She's very, like, I think this is a very strong word, but she's very, very well known. She's got her own eyeshadow palette and everything. It's Carly Bible. And she had made a video not too long ago, maybe like last week or this week. She had made a video on this, and she was like, you know, Demonstrating how to like shave right here and like your unibrow and then like the peach fuzz that you get like on your upper lip and stuff. I don't get hair like uh, on my face, like your obvious places. Like right here, I don't have I don't have that problem. I do have her like get like the little unibrow and then like I have like a very like you can see my peach fuzz so bad. I used it today and I used it a little bit right here. And that was, I mean, it was, it was scary, but I mean, it was okay, nothing wrong. And then it does come with a cap, and there's three in one, so that was like the only one that I've opened. 
Another one that I haven't used is the Physician's Formula, the powder palette in the Mineral Glow Pearl. And this says it's for all skin tones, so, and that, like, color looks like such a pretty highlight to have, like, right here. And, like, to put, like, on the bridge of your nose, in the middle of your forehead, and, like, on your cupid's bow. And that might be a little bit raw here, and, like, you know. But, yeah. So, if you guys want swatches on any of these, or, like, um, a first impressions video on, like, oh, I can kind of sort of do a look on this. I mean, the brush is small. Anyways. Revlon, I got eyelash curler. The only thing I don't like about this, which I should have painted, so it's on me, is it came with the rhinestones. I feel like that's so dangerous to have by your eye. But I mean, can't go wrong. It works good. New to me, not L, but this product, I was recommended. It was recommended to me by my fancy sister. It is the Eye Refresh. It's the Elf Studio. And it's in the color clear. I have no idea what this is or how to go about this. But I guess that's like the, when you open it. That's there. So I don't know about this. That's super new to me. Um, a repurchase, which I love, is the Elf Makeup Remover Cleaning White. These work so good for me personally. It takes off all of your makeup it takes off the glue from your eyelashes waterproof mascara eyeliner liquid eyeliner like it does it all for me so new to me which i'm super excited is the corrective yellow it is the high definition powder from oh so you know that these are super good so i'm excited to try this next I have, are these, are these all BB creams? Uh, three BB creams, so let's just talk about the BB creams. This one is uh, Magic Skin Butter BB Cream in Anti-Fatigue. The L'Oreal Paris, that looks like this. Let's see, transforms to universal shade to awaken complexion. So that sounds very nice. I haven't tried it. It's all wrapped and everything. So, yes, people, I broke a nail on this hand and I broke a nail on this hand. I need to get my life together right now. Back to the haul because I'm being distracted about my nail. Is this also Magic Skin Butter BB Cream in Fair? It's four beautifying actions in one. Primes, corrects, hydrates, and perfects flawless bare skin finish. That's what that looks like. So, and then this one, Magic Skin Butter BB Cream in Anti Redness. Transforms to universal shade to reduce the look of redness. And that's this one. I'm excited to use this one because I am getting red like right here. So I'm thinking that's like and like a little bit right here. And I'm thinking that's kind of typical, I guess. I don't know. Maybe the weather. I don't know. This little cutie it is magic anti-redness. Sorry about that. There was a little on the door. You're like super happy. Okay. Next is Maybelline. I got two foundations in two different colors that are similar to make my color, which is the 220 Natural Beige. And yeah. And then the 130 Buff Beige. So those are the numbers. They look like. They're like barely even different. So got those. Also, what I got, let's see what are these. This is the Master Duo, the two in one glossy liquid liner. That's this a beauty. Look at that. Woo! And I didn't mention this one. It's the Anti Ennis Corrective Primer Base Corrector, and that's in L'Oreal. So that's this looks super cute. Next, here by me, and next by Maybelline is the, oh, sorry, the, this one is in number 500 black, so, 
This one is 225 Soft Brown. And the Brow Define Fill du Duo. This comes with like a pencil and then like a little sponge. And this is in the color Soft Brown. So see right here, it shows a little sponge and then the applicator right there. So that looks super fun. Hopefully it's in my color to see like, <laughs> no, it's not like too like boom in your face. This one is a 701, the Unstoppable. So it says, this is special volume that there's two in there. This is all day wear smudge resistant. So that's that. It's just a regular black. I don't know, to me it looks super special and I was like, why not? And then I believe lastly, and the last two items, I didn't get any lipstick this time, so that was kind of like a, because I had to stop myself because uh, I kind of went over budget because I think I only went to Walmart for like food, and that's what I came back with. But it's the Milani's. I got the 102 dark brown, and I got the 103 natural taupe, and it is. I've seen, I believe it's these ones, but they look like this. Oh, no. Yeah, and then like the little pencil like in the bottom. But I believe it was this exact same thing that um, loved Michelle, her channel. She used a lot of Milani. I wasn't into Milani until I seen her videos. So, thank you. For inspiring me to use Milani and move outside my box. Um, so shout out to her. But yeah, I think it's these and her eyebrows look amazing and stuff. Because my eyebrows are so thin and they like don't grow. They don't do anything. So I'm trying to work on it and everything. And this is my look that I did with my 120 palette. Oh my god, I'm in love with it. If you guys want me to show you guys that in a different video with a lot of like swatches and stuff with these ones, let me know like the swatches for like the highlight and stuff. And then it was my last, mm, yeah, this is my last haul. Oh, I got a bunch of things too, and believe it or not, I haven't opened them. It's so sad. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the little haul. I hope it wasn't too long for you guys. And I know that my videos are all, all over the place. They're like makeup there. Um, what? No. I'm looking. No. What? That's the end of my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm sorry that my hauls are all over the place because there's like makeup days in the life updates of my kids which i am going to be getting into that i am going to be talking about me and her update she's almost one i'm starting to order things to um to do her party and then aries's birthdays and also literally like the day before her birthday before nia's so i have through let's count cousin she doesn't live here so it's not count here but it's my birthday okay it's my stepdaughter's birthday my birthday my sister's birthday, Aries's birthday, and then my daughter's birthday. So it's a lot of birthdays in one month. And then you got Christmas before it and stuff. So I want to be doing Christmas hauls and stuff and activities you can do with your kids starting now if you want. I want to be doing a Thanksgiving one if you guys want. Stay tuned for that. But um, love you guys. XOXO. And life is too short to live the same day twice. So enjoy you guys' day, night, evening, and everything, and my prayers go out to Paris. It's such a sad, sad story of what happened, and my prayers are with everyone there and their families and friends. So bye, guys, till the next video.